What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Stray here in the Backlog. I am Base637, the as always gracious host. Now, in the last episode, we had made it up to the point where we got the atomic battery from the factory. We were trying to get back to Clementine, but sure as shit, everything has gone topsy turvy. I don't know who, but someone called the buzz. Seems like we got a little bit of a, you know, fishy situation on our hands. Which is kind of ironic, seeing as we are a cat and we do love us some fish. But that is also not the point. I can not jump up. Okay. Sorry, trying to think of the fly here. Bit. Essentially, right now, we are trying to get back up to Clementine's place, but we are currently surrounded by these uh, flies, so to speak. They're drones, but, well, they're insects. They, they're annoying. They're a nuisance. We're trying to find a way up and around because, as you can see here, this area right here is kind of uh, locked up by some chains. Or not even chains. Just, like, you know, some bars. Looks kind of prison-esque, don't you think? Anywho, that's beyond the point. Now, we are trying to fucking get around that. And I'm trying to figure out exactly which way I need to go to do just that. We're gonna move up to another box here. I don't think there's anyone in there that will let me in. Now's not the time. Heading in the box. Okay, now, if only this was like Metal Gear Solid where I could just move the box around, that'd be far more convenient. I think I'm starting to get a better idea what we gotta do here. We just gotta go up the other staircase, you know, take the long way around the scenic route. Oh, country roads, take me home to a place where I'll fuck. Yeah, that's exactly where I want to be for that. You don't seem to care that I'm here. Okay. My next question is... To get around you. You know, do kitty things. Be exactly the kind of kitty that I want to be. I mean, Ember here has had a hell of a fucking time. Just trying to deal with this city as it is. I mean, it's lovely. Don't get me wrong. Okay, sweet. We're in. We have infiltrated Fort Knox. Good thing we're not after that gold. Another clue board. Clem? Hmm. No sign of Clementine. Oh, my darling, oh, my darling, oh, my darling, Clementine, where are you? Oh, what's that? It's some kind of coded message. We're going to have to play detective to figure out what happened to her. Look! Or B-12 and the cat. Answer lies in my stuff. Then there's four symbols. Signed Clementine. Take a look. Lava lamp, traffic cone, mineral, plant, with an onion. Okay, thankfully we have that on hand. We have to do it in order, is my question. First one is that plant with the onion. Onion plant. I mean, I gotta make a very important Sunday. I need that onion. Hello. You found something? Hmm. I don't see anything. Are you sure? Maybe we have to hit it from the back? No, there's no way to get at it from the back. Access denied. Looking for an onion plant. Onion plant. Hone. Huh. What an odd thing to have in an apartment. Is this why the companions... Is this the way the companions here see humans? It's kind of funny. 
Look, something's been left here. It says, blankety, blankety, blank, come to blank. Okay. So, it doesn't look like we have to do it in order. Incense thing, not mineral. Okay. My sensors can only detect harmless chemicals in a gaseous state. They can't recreate the calming sensation I remember. Like me, the companions can't smell, so I wonder why they do this. There's also a message hidden under the container. I'm with blank, come to blank. Okay. That was the mineral, we found the cone. Well, that's what I thought was the mineral. Found the cone already. What were the other two? Lava lamp, which is actually right here. At least I would think, but apparently not. It might be the one... Excuse me. Yeah, I know, I'm looking for a lava lamp in a hippie's place. That's gonna take a little bit of doing. Ooh, I can take a nap, but... I can't sleep, neither can you. That's just a weird optical illusion. Oh, there actually wasn't a mineral I needed to grab. <laughs> this gem is of medium value and low purity. The glow seems to have an added artificial. The glow is. Wow. This gem is of medium value and low purity. The glow seems to have been added artificially. Maybe it acts as a beacon for us to find something useful. Bingo! There is a message. It says. I believe it was, I'm here, come to, blank, blazer, blank, blank, blank. And lava lamp? Once I find the lava lamp, I will know exactly how to put this together. I just want to know where the lava lamp is. It can't be in here. Probably the one up there. Is that shaped like a heart? Yes, it is. Oh, she likes me. I have no idea what this is, but its glow is kind of mesmerizing. Sorry, I, I was elsewhere. I didn't even notice this message here. It reads nightclub. Okay, I don't even need to put. Oh, I'm with Blazer. Come to the nightclub. That's it. Well done, Lutek. Let's go find her. We don't have much time. Can I circumvent having to deal with all this? You know what? Oh god. Well, I was gonna go guns blazing. Nope, 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 nope. Fuck it. You'll never take me alive! I think that's kind of your game plan. Look, man. I'm all for a little bit of a, you know, electro play, but let's keep the diodes away from the anus. I'd, I'd appreciate that. I think that'd be a messy time for all of us involved. Okay, the nightclub was over here, and there's that bouncer saying I couldn't get in. Apparently, I'm not cool enough of a cat in order to be let in. <clears throat> it's not for you. Go away. Can I bribe you the battery? A bribe? I don't take bribes. I value my work. What is that, anyway? I don't think the bouncer is gonna let us in. Hey guys, I think I think we're going to have to climb at the back again. Dance a groove levels at two percent. Please find a dancing spot immediately. I hate this club. It's full of posers. But at least there's no sentinels there. Why are you confused by me? You like me. I did you a favor, but I gotta go around back apparently, so... How do I, uh, go knocking on that back door? I mean, obviously I'm going to have to ask nice. 
And probably climb a little bit up and a little bit over and, you know, work some magic. Sweet talk, it set the mood. Maybe you can open a door for me. I work hard to clean the streets, only for others to mess it up again. Anyway, that's how the world works. Hey, I mean, you're not wrong. Just wait. Announcement. If you're looking for some company to talk to... If you're looking for some company to talk to about poetry, I live behind the elevator. Bonabo. Hmm. Alright, and you were definitely not there before. Uh, I'm trying to remember how I got... Ah, this is how I got up and over there. Who in the fuck are you? You're... Glittery and gold. Hey, I got... Lit killer. Howdy! How are you doing today? I was expecting a little more out of you. I don't know why. And that's why we remember to keep a hello. Hey, how'd you get up here? Wanna party with us? Here, jump in and go get a drink. I will avoid your oil concoctions, but I appreciate the entry access. Thank you kindly. And you are down for the count. And this is kind of hilarious. Guys, I think your friend needs a little assistance and what the hell is on your head? Because it's kind of sick and I want one. That is kind of awesome, actually. Like, legitimately. That's impressive. Who are you? Steve. You like my mask? I made it myself! It jams the Sentinel scans, and it looks cool! That is actually very awesome. How do I make one? How? Ah. Well, I think you might be a little spun out there, Wash. And again, you're in the right venue for it. Cooler. Give it to the left. Ah, ah. Give it to the right. Oh, yeah. Beep, boop, sweep, sweep. It's called the Zygma Dance. Okay, okay. I see you. You're getting funky. Club sucks. I'm not trying to go to this stupid VIP room. They kick me out. Can you believe it? Oh, I stole this lever just for the kids. If you get me a drink, I'll give you the silly lever. I don't need it, and I don't want to be caught with it. Why don't you just... You know what? I understand the whole idea of scratch my back, I scratch yours. I paid extra to get tonight's dance moves from the bouncer. He's the one programming the holograms in his spare time. Hmm. Can I get up there and talk to them? Because if so, that, uh, I think I can. Hey everybody, DJ Matsy here. Let's get the party started. This first song has been requested by our very questionable friend, Blazer. I was hoping to, you know, fuck up your time a little bit more. I see, I see. Hmm. I know which I haven't found them yet. They must be in the VIP room. That's the only thing I can think of. Hey, customer. The access to the VIP balcony is closed. Some private business is going on there. It has been reserved by some blazer guy, I think. Uh, can I get a beverage there, sir? Hello again, dear customer. I've had several complaints, so no, we can't disable the holiday dance because some idiot thought it was funny to steal the lever handle. Anyway, you want to drink something? That's some quite advanced technology you got there. Okay, so I need a glass. Take. Sorry, you have been ganked. For the what's going on here? Um.
These are not the droids you are looking for? Oh. Okay. When I was human, my friends and I would gather and party long into the night, even if we had to suffer the annoying consequences the next morning. It felt good to find joy despite the unlivable surface. And the underground living conditions becoming more and more squalid. And the capitalistic greed of companies like Necocor. And the police state created by the Sentinels. Now I remember why we were doing that. I have skipped a good chunk of the memories. Holy shit. We will definitely be cleaning those up towards the end of this playthrough here. Hmm. That explains why I had to take special elevator access. Anything else down here that I can use to do? Probably not, realistically. Going back up. I mean, I got a drink, so I can go get that liver. Hmm. Go figure. Someone's asking for a drink to lubricate that lever. Yes. That joke is bad, man. I, I feel questionable about it. This club sits. When I tried to go to that stupid VIP room, they kicked me out. Me? Can you believe it? So I stole this lever just for the kids. You get me a drink, I'll give you this silly lever. I don't need it, and I don't want to get caught with it. Ooh, thanks, my friend. Here you go, as promised. Why do I get a bad feeling about that? I just took a strange drink. Are you about to fucking collapse on me? Okay, cool. I'm not a monster. If I hear you collapse, I'm gonna feel real bad. Boop. Going up. That's the way we do it around here. What does this button do? Oh. Okay. I see. So I kind of need those. And what does this one do? Aha. I think, I think I did not crack that code. I do see where I gotta go, though. And if I do that again... Of course we need that one down too. Goddamn close. They don't rotate or anything either, do they? Oh, there's a third button I didn't see. Boop. Hey. <laughs> now, I think we're cooking with some gas. Maybe not. Oh, come on. Nothing is ever easy. Why do I have the feeling this is not going to work? Probably not.
Tell me your secret. <laughs> That's one way of doing it, but I can't reach that like that. Aha, I think that did it. Yep, that one did it. Clementine! Or not. Raph. I have a very good relationship with the Sentinels. I don't understand why people complain about them so much. Well, you see, uh, I'll let you believe what you want. That's a code of some kind. Ember, what you got, huh? Can you make it out? 3194? I'll try to remember that if there's a safe around here. Save her a door. Hmm. Oh, inside? Hmm. Hmm. How does that. Hmm. Hmm. We've been double crossed. Blazer, you bastard. <laughs> Two birds with one stone. You're not as clever as you look, little cat. Anyway, nothing personal. Business is business. Business is money. And I value money way more than friendship or camaraderie. They're all yours. Okay, okay. Please tell me we're alright, Ember. You're a tough little kitty. I think it's like six lives left. Alright, little buddy, I know you are. And we just got an achievement, Alcatraz. AK. Apparently I am... I am in a jail cell. And B12 is nowhere to be found. Oh god. Well, boys. Ring wheels are off. We're all alone again. Oh, great. We've lost our family. We lost our one true friend in this fucking area. Let alone our fucking, you know, translator. Oh, God, Clementine's also taken. God only knows what's happening with her. Still have no idea what the fuck happened to Momo. Momo. You're the true MVP. I'm willing to give it all to the cause. May you rest in peace, but I'm hoping to God there will be a special guest appearance. Alright, but in any case, I am actually all out of time for this episode here. So thank you all so much for watching. If you've been enjoying what you've been seeing with Stray so far, don't be afraid to leave a like on the video. And if you want to see more, all you have to do is subscribe. If there's anything you want to tell me down in the comment section below, by all means, I'll keep my eyes peeled. And if you were chomping at the bit, trying to figure out when the next episode is going to drop, even before I get a chance to drop it, all you've got to do is click that little bell, it will tell you everything you need to know. That being said, I am Basics37. Reminding you all, stay current out there, everybody.